Worst case scenario, Rona walks. Kim builds her super vets up the road. We are toast. Not necessarily. Maybe we can find another investor. Would you invest in a practice that's just lost a third of its clients? No. We are definitely toast. Unless there's a way of letting her buy in, but we keep control. Have you met Kim Tate? She's not the only one who can be ruthless. I'm listening. I don't know. It sounds like a load of stress. Can't you put it off until you're better? What's happening now? I, mean, I didn't get the say the first time because they decided I was too poorly to have an opinion. You can't blame them for being so slow. I know. So would you really leave if they turn it down again? It'd be the end of an era, but... Yeah, I think I would. I've worked too hard to stay and watch that vet scramble around me. You think I'm mad, don't you? Oh, I think it'd be nice to help you make your mind up. But I also think you know what you're doing. So I've got you back either way. Hey, uh, sorry to butt in, but we've made a decision. So we're doing business here now, are we? How quaint. Might not get to the business bit. Um, Paddy has an alternative proposal. Let's hear it. We're willing to accept the figure that you offered. For 25%, not 50. Go on. And we'd split mine and Vanessa's share in the sale, so we'd hold the majority share between us. OK. Which, in turn, would mean that you could be outvoted on any major decision going forward. Fine. Fine. So, in essence, you'd be a silent partner, a director in name only, no clout, no sway. Works for me. Graham, would you arrange the paperwork, please? Absolutely. Oh, charity's going to eat me alive. You've not mentioned it. Is Chaz in the loop? No, I haven't got a death wish. Look, we'll just have to break it to them gently. Yeah, we just kind of drop the odd hint. You don't have to know every single fact straight away, do they? Yeah, it's better than telling them we've got no business left at all. Yeah. And then we'll get back to making that practice great, safe in the noise that we're at the helm. I'll get you another drink. Put it on the tab. He's marvellous. Has he got any brothers? Uh, one's taken, one's dead, and the other one's on the run. Oh, shame. You surprised me today, Kim. I got a decent ship. But no control. It was a hard no this morning. And now we're sealing the deal. I think it's clear who's calling the shots. And you're finally back in the good books with your son? Uh, about that. I haven't actually managed to get in touch. You said that he needed a job. Yeah, which is true. He just doesn't know that I've provided one for him. <sighs> well, don't you need to find him and tell him, then? Yes. That's where you come in. <laughs>